Oh boy, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I, uh, I messed up. I uh, didn't properly end the last stream. So, it's two and a half hours long, where about half an hour of that is actual gameplay, and the rest of it is just nothing. It doesn't exist. It's not real. It's just black. It's, 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 I don't know what it is. I'm gonna try and fix it later. But right now, I want to get back to the game, and I figured, even though I could have just continued with that old stream, then I'd have to, like, I don't know, work my magic to make it not suck, so I just made a new one. Uh, plus, that would help notify people that I'm actually back, rather than, you know, just assuming that... I, I, I don't know. It's a mess. It's a big old mess. Anyway, I'm gonna... I'm gonna get started again. Let's go ahead and uh, resume the world. Ay ay ay, though, man, that's a that's a that's a big old nasty mess of a situation right there. I don't even know if my settings are right for this one. I literally just like I I, I threw everything together. It's a big old, it's it's you know, it's rough. I just I was in too much of a hurry, and now I paid the price. Hopefully I get, um, I can fix everything. Hopefully it's actually working right now, because it might not be. If it's not working right now, I'm going to cry. Okay, yeah, it's working now. Okay, it's working. Okay. Great. Got it. Good. Why did I open Skittles when I'm going to be playing? I'm such a... Dumb human being. Okay. Right. Um. Hmm. I don't know what else to make him hold. Actually, yes, I do. Hold this hammer. Alright. And honestly, hold these. And, um... Maybe hold... Bernie? I don't know. Yeah. That frees up my inventory a little bit. Well, it's too late now to go back on my poor decision, so I might as well keep eating. Otherwise, I'm just gonna have open Skittles all over the place. Like, what kind of cruel human being does that, you know? <laughs> right. I actually might have enough to prototype an alchemy engine. But not right now. I'm gonna wait. So here's a swamp. This is gonna be interesting. I will grab reeds since I have Chester though. Mm. Oh god. I see someone is joined. <gasps> A tentacle spike. I need this. A weapon. A tool of destruction. Oh, here's some silk. That'll always come in handy eventually, probably. Let's go ahead and store this away in Chester, though. God, please, tentacle man, don't hit me. I'm so worried. 
Why does the swamp have to suck so much? Oh, I can't even say hi. Hey. There we go. But hey, I know where a bunch of gears are now, so that's pretty cool, right? If I was confident in my kiting ability, or if I had armor, I would totally actually just kill those guys. Mm, nowhere yet. Dude, it's day five. Like, just, just go. Just do stuff. Just do stuff. You shouldn't have to depend on me. I see, we've got some warfare going on here. I realize Chester and Merms kind of sound similar. Whoa, hey, buddy. Come on now, I haven't done anything against you, I just want this tentacle spike. Yeah, that's right, leave me alone. This is a pretty decent sized swamp too. Ah, here we go. Finally, one of these. Like what? I don't care. Act like I'm not here. <laughs> wow, we've got a real uh, comedy gold funny man on our side. get something down. But for now, it's just exploration time. Give me one of my tentacle spikes back, please. What, what does he want now? You know, I, at this rate, I almost prefer the, like, quiet people who don't talk much over the people who are overly needy. Like, I don't care what you do. If you want to come to my base, there isn't one yet. So, for now, keep yourself busy. Oh, I do need the flint, so I should probably pick it up. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> I don't get it. What what's the what's the what's with this guy? Time to make a forest fire. He's Wartox though. I was looking to see if he was Willow maybe, because you know. Willow does the forest fires, but... No, he's just Wartox, and he's just weird. Well, at least if he's Wartox, even if he is, like, inept, he should still be able to survive on his own. Alright, 
Let's go ahead then and make another pickaxe. All right. Um, yeah, I'm going to keep following the world border. I don't need to go deeper into that biome for now. And yes, I know, Willow, you're hungry, but, like, I prefer to not eat my food. I would prefer if I could just eat butterflies, but uh, I suppose I might have to feed you, which is just, you know, unfortunate. Right, let's go ahead and place down a campfire, I guess. I don't know, like here. And let's go ahead and start doing science stuff. Which means opening my gift. Hey, a winter's feast chest. Alright. Now what do we need? We need... Four cut stone. Easy. We need two batteries. Sorry, should I call them electrical doodads? We don't even have enough boards? Are you kidding me? Alright, um, for now, drop this. Oh, you know what? Maybe I should have made a backpack first so that way I could actually have some storage space. Right, that makes sense. Hey, butterfly. And you know what? Might as well just use these birch nut seeds for food. Oh, okay, you know what? Screw you too, buddy. What does this guy mean he's lost? There's a map? One. Two. I, I, like, the whole world is just kind of there. Like, the point is to not know where you're going most of the time. There's nowhere to go to be lost from. But ain't this just a bit, bit of a problem, you know? I can't even use my science machine. Or can I? Okay, well, it turns out he actually doesn't care that I'm doing it. Alright, well, as long as I just stay over here, I guess he doesn't really care what I do. Okay, false. He cares. I would kill him, except for actually no. Uh, I don't want to deal with him at all. Also, yeah, I just realized I should probably respond to that guy, otherwise he's just going to leave and get bored. Which almost might be preferable at this rate, though. Alright, let's go ahead and chop some more trees. Because I do need more wood. And while we're at it, we can kill some more butterflies. Come on, how did I miss? There we go. Well, oh well, I just wasted a swing on this axe. Oops. Oopsie. No, don't pick up the flower well. Is this guy gonna tell me every little thing he does?
And would you look at that butter? All right, let's head back to the science machine. Oh my God. All right, we need two rope in order to make a log suit. You found a sinkhole. Right. I'm actually gonna keep the tentacle spike for a uh, later use. Are you kidding me? Leave me alone. And he's gotta go now. Sweet, great. Honestly, the preferred outcome. <laughs> There we go. Okay, now I'm liking this a bit better. Let's go ahead and break this. There we go. Alright, sweet. So we're all geared up. Now, of course, all that's left to do is to find a favorable base location. Let's see. Where do I have explored on my map? Dragonfly Desert, Swamp, some beef flow right here. Ay, ay, ay. Nothing real good so far. Oh, someone has joined. Hey. Mark the shark 223, huh? What a catchy name. Just rolls right off the tongue, really. Hey, a spider. You wanna die? Sure, I'll keep these. Um, monster meat, I'm not so sure about if I should keep or not, but whatever. Fizz has joined the game. Hey, look at that. We're starting to get some activity. What is that? There we go. A creative uh, introduction. Okay, let's see. Mark the Shark is a Weber, and uh, we've got a Wilson. So, yeah. Would you look at that? Now, those two, since they just uh, joined, like, side by side, they'll probably find each other, probably explore together, probably do stuff. As for me, I mean, I might be headed back in the general direction of spawn. Who knows? I could run into one of them. Potentially. Alright. Back into the gold biome it is. And that's fine, because I need some more gold anyway. More gold, more rocks, more flint, just everything you could possibly ask for. Alright, let's go ahead and cook these birch nuts and eat them so they're not taking up inventory space. There we go, and let's go ahead and cook like two of these bad boys. There we go, easy enough. Hmm, alright. And we'll grab a couple skittles while we're sitting still. Oh, I see I've received a discord message, huh? Okay, let's see, let's see what it says. Hmm, not in important. Okay. Back to the game then.
So far, the performance is good, though. As far as I can tell, no one's lagging. Nope. It is day seven. Now is about the time people would probably expect to have a base up. But I like to take extra time in my exploration. Right. Hmm, you know what? I'm actually gonna... Stop following the edge of the world for a quick sec, because I actually want some, some gold, some more gold from this place. So let's go ahead and grab the pickaxe and get mining. Oh, no, come on. Come here, butterfly. Got it. Sweet. Oh, I didn't need to pick these. Alright, whatever. I'll just eat them. I like to have a stack of food on me so that way even if I don't end up eating it all, I've got rot. Does this mean it's spring? No. <laughs> Not at all spring. No, no, no. <laughs> So I see that the Weber is a noob. Yeah, fair enough. Spring is way later, and Fizz seems to be at least somewhat experienced, so... Thought I could make that distinction. Hey! I've received a Steam message. received another message. <laughs> Hold on. Gotta focus on... Yeah, there we go. Killing. Murder. You know how it is. Uh, let's go ahead and put... Wait, why don't I just put away the full stack of rocks? Yeah. That's the smart thing to do. Here. Let me reply to this Steam message. What? And now we've got a nice little tall bird egg. I might actually try and hatch this one. Why? Because, I don't know, I'm insane and I'm bored. Mostly just bored. Alright. We're nearly full up on gold, so... <laughs> Poor guy. Alright, sweet. We've got all the gold we could ever possibly need, and we've got lots of food. And I mean lots of food. Like more food than we probably need also. Well, I'm trying to catch them on fire, so that way I can just, you know, eat the meat right away, but whatever. Fine. I guess I'll just cook it on my lighter and then eat it. Wait, wait. Wait, what is a rock den? Oh, sorry. Um... It's for pets. Oh, I get the joke. Named my thumbnail dinner bone so it would flip upside down, huh? Well, no, um, 
If you want to know the truth, I just kind of flipped it upside down because, um... This was meant to be one stream, but now it's accidentally split into two streams because I had to go get a haircut in the middle of it. And so, in order to keep them closely related, I've just taken the original thumbnail and flipped it upside down. Uh, also, I, once I'm done with this one, I have to go back and fix the original one because I forgot to click the stop streaming button. So it's now like two hours long where it's absolutely nothing. Which is just fantastic. Alright. But, you know, whatever. That's what I get for being stupid, I guess. Five? Huh? Oh, gold. Oh. Man, these people, they like to, uh, they like to talk. They like to keep up to date on every little detail. Well, whatever, at least they have each other now, and I don't have to do all the talking. Hey, there's some berries being picked over here. That means someone's probably been here recently. Alright. Ooh, I see a tree being chopped, or has been chopped. Show yourself. What did I say that to? Hounds? Ah, yes, hounds. Oh, no. Uh... They probably won't attack you. What's a loot stash? I think that's... Grampus? But yeah, the hounds probably won't attack them because they've barely been on the world long enough. Yeah, they're only two days a, pi a pop, so, you know, not a whole bunch of time. I will defend this egg with my life. Come on, hounds. I'm waiting. Oop, too hot. Alright, whatever. I'll just keep moving, and once they attack, they attack. Hey, a butterfly. Butterfly, come back. I want you in my belly. Killed by a red cap? Are you kidding me? Of all the things. Alright, well. Oh, and he just left. Hey, I got a candy cane. That's nice. And a hound's tooth, so that'll come in handy for making uh, repair kits for Bernie. Let's see. So this is a big old mosaic biome. Oh, hi, Meta. Small bird is the most adorable pet and don't starve. Um, I don't know, because I, I don't mess with pets that much, so I don't really remember what all of them are. What about Glom Glom? Isn't that a pet? The little Glomer? I know there's like a new moth pet for the return of them. And, uh, it, like, actually glows and gives off light during night, so I kind of wanted- I've always been wanting to try that one out, but I just never get around to it. Got seven gold. Right. <laughs> I just love the, the- the constant updates, you know. I get, I get to know every single time he picks up an individual piece of gold. Alright. If you're skilled enough, as in if you keep just randomly trying, eventually you'll accidentally hit the rabbit. Yeah, but I give up. Nine. <laughs> I 
Right, and let's just cook this right away because I don't want it taking up my inventory. Hello, beefalo. I actually might kill one of you right now just so I could maybe get your horn. Although I don't really have room for it. Alright, what can we drop from in here? Honestly, probably don't need the gland. So, just use that, I guess. So yeah, let's go ahead and try and actually kill one of these guys then. Just gotta lure him, like, way far away enough to where his friend won't get upset when I start to murder him. Glom Glom is a pet too, but small bird or teen bird helps on hunting, but small bird isn't that strong and when they're adults they kill you. Oh, you mean this small bird? I thought you meant like the little turkey pet from the den. You mean like this actual bird, right. Oh my god! Where'd that bunny come from? <laughs> Holy cow. Anyway. Four or five something. Yeah, it's like five or six swings. Then you just dodge. What? Now how did that hit me? Okay, that that makes sense, because I uh I just sucked. Let's meet up and decide an area for base. I'm still exploring, my dude. Alright, I do need to keep the beef low wool, though. Lauren, though. Alright, what, what can we put away into my belly, I guess? I'll just eat this, actually. This that probably works. And honestly, let's just dump the green caps. Don't don't really need them. Oh, hello, many beefalo. I didn't get my horn, which is unfortunate, but if I find a more isolated beefalo, then I will I will murder again to see if I can get it to drop. I'm excited for the next character rework, but I don't think that's going to be coming out for quite a while. I'm just really curious as to who it will be, because um, they, they've they already hit like the, the characters who heavily needed reworked, like Willow and Winona, and even Woody, I guess, kind of like really needed a rework, but I don't know. The remaining characters, they don't especially need them. I mean, I think Maxwell next could be reworked because the way he just works and don't starve together is a little it's a little wonky so he might need uh reworked next but other than that i have no idea who who it could be they're probably not going to touch the uh the characters that people deem as you know op the top tiers if you will for a while because you know they're probably, by changing them, they're actually probably just going to make them worse instead of better, and then people are going to be upset because their good characters aren't good anymore or something. I don't know. Who knows? Also, did not end up finding that isolated beefalo while I've been uh, following the edge purely, but it looks like this should loop back up and around, maybe. Oh, a wormhole and a sinkhole, huh? Two forms of travel right next to, uh, Pig King. Right, and I think this is, uh, is this a spider quarry? Oh my goodness, it is. I think I found where base should be. Right. Hey, buzz off. Here, I'm gonna do something real quick then. Found Pig King. He is next to a spider qua quarry.
and beefalo. So this is actually a pretty good spot. A sink hole and worm hole. Right, so if I can ignite a flare for him. Oh, I saw the pan flute. I just didn't feel like picking it up right now. I need to head down to the spider quarry though, so I can get a, um, a, whatchamacallit, you know, a, a nighter, so that way I can give him direction. I can give him purpose. Alright, let's go ahead then, and drop this bad boy right here, and light. Inventory is looking pretty stuffed right now, not gonna lie. I need to get down some stuff. I just don't know where to put the base exactly, because, you know, that other guy's a Weber, and I don't want to put it right inside the Pig King. Maybe I should put it, like, uh, I don't know, here, in this little clearing nearish the Pig King. Maybe here, at this four-way intersection. Yeah, this... This little four-way intersection spot seems pretty nice, so we'll chop down the nearby trees and stuff in order to make room for a base. Alright, let's go ahead then, uh, before I drive myself insane even more by literally not having any room to put anything down, let's go ahead and place our alchemy engine. And let's go ahead and place our campfire pit, like right here. Oh really, Dan? You're getting your PC. That sounds exciting. Alright, let's go ahead then and make a hand bat, plus we can make a football helmet. Alright, so now we can start dropping some stuff over here. We're probably not going to need any of this stuff anytime soon, so let's go ahead and get rid of that. And uh, put the pan flute inside Chester, which he is full, actually. So let's go ahead and drop a couple things out of Chester here. Honestly, I might keep the pan flute inside Chester, because that's just something nice to have on you. Um... But let's go ahead and drop everything else outside of Chester. What? Alright, and let's start making some actual chests, maybe. <laughs> that way we don't have to live like poor people. Hey, a gingerbread chest! I didn't know you could make these. Right, so, let's go ahead then and start placing some stuff in there. Rocks, that's important. That's important. This is important. The tooth can be in here as important. The reeds can go in here, also important. The pine cones, sure, why not? The logs, just keep those on me, and the tools can all stay out here, and then this and this can just go in there, I guess. Uh, put the flint in there too, because I actually don't need that, and voila! Now, we just need to make our gold tools. There we go, just like that. 
And now we've got a nice little base started. Next, I'm probably going to need to make like crockpot and stuff, so I'm going to start burning uh, trees and whatnot for charcoal. Then I know where a bunch of gears are to get the ice boxes, but first I want to make like four crockpots at least. Let's go ahead and clear out the area. Oh, I see. Hello, Wilson. Wait. Oh, you're Wilson. I thought you were Weber. The other guy must have been Weber. My bad. Die, you foul creature. The chat is a lot livelier in Twitch. Well, I don't know, I just kind of like YouTube, okay? Please die, you demon. There we go. Okay, so this probably doesn't need to be in there, and what else in here probably doesn't need to be in here like that, yeah. Oh, poor guy. Hey, you! Stop eating my pig skins! Ah, dang it, I wanted to give him those, but the spider ate them all. Ay ay ay. Right, well, whatever. Oh, I do need this charcoal, though, so thank you, my good sir. Oh, this mohorm had gears in it. All right, fair enough. Let's go ahead and cook some nice food. Right. And we'll even start hatching this egg a little bit more. Okay. What's up, Wilson? Alright, I'm gonna start burning some trees, I guess, for charcoal. Don't worry, it's a controlled forest fire, I think. <laughs> egg? Oh yeah, the tall bird egg. Oh, it's, it's hot. You're right, you're right, you're right. Thank you. <laughs> Jeez, I almost let that uh, egg go to waste. Hey Chester, how's it uh, feel? <laughs> Nice and warm. Also, we've got a bee field right here. That's something I didn't even know until now. Oh, didn't want to pick those, actually. We will hatch this tall bird egg if it's the last thing I do. Also, I completely forgot I'm immune to fire, so I can just stand inside this fire for protection. Yeah, that's right. Try and sting me, bees.
All right, well. Glad to have you on the team, Wilson. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, let's see here then. So now that we got a couple of things going, we can start prototyping some uh, crackpots. We just need redstone. Two, three, to make a crockpot right, right here. Crockpot, easy, boom, done. Then we just cook this all together and you got yourself some nice meaty balls. By the way, small birds can only eat berries and seeds. Meanwhile, teen slash tall birds can eat meat too. Okay, good to know. Oh, there's a little gingerbread man. There we go. Ah, oh, I see. Wilson's got us covered with the lightning rod already. Okay, so I'm going to need more of our stone if I want to make... Ah, well, I see. Our stone has almost disappeared. If I want to make two more crock pots, I'm going to need six more cut stone. Then we can start making some ice boxes in here. Oh, I'm going to need more charcoal, aren't I? All right, well, whatever. I can do that. Let's get some more charcoal then. And down with the cat. <laughs> okay, so let's go ahead and just chill right by the fire. <laughs> While I'm waiting for these to burn and give me charcoal, I might as well have some Skittles. Uh-oh, need to move. Stop being hot, I'm not even near the fire. Hmm. That's lucky for you, Dan. Oh, and hey, look at this. <laughs> I'm, I like how I'm one step ahead of him. So how's this charcoal coming? Oh, well, kind of slow, but whatever. And we're about to have 37 rod on our hands, which is pretty dang impressive. All right, so this is enough for that final crock pot. For now. We might need more crock pot in the future, but Done. Easy. Alright. So now we can make ice boxes, which will take just a couple of cut stones, huh? One, two, three, and four. Because I do want to make four ice boxes, believe it or not. I know, I sound criminally insane, but trust me. 
Just get out of here, please. Oh wow, that hit me from quite a distance away. Alright, let's go ahead and make a couple more ice boxes then. Oh yeah, I forgot, Willow actually is more effective at lighting the fire too. That's something I always seem to forget. There we go, look at that. Now isn't that just lovely? Um... If you want, I'm probably gonna do other stuff. I'm probably gonna do other stuff. Okay, there we go. Hmm. Oh, that's just gonna turn into rot. There we go, and we can store some food away. Oh yeah, I forgot to let the egg, um, sort of mature during the night. Okay, what do we need more now? Uh, I need more twigs, personally, but also we could use some more charcoal and, uh, whatnot for... Actually, we could use some more stuff for drying racks. Because we're gonna probably be producing meat out the wazoo in this biome. So, the more jerky, the better. Yeah. That sounds like a logical plan. Eh. I have Bernie, so we'll be fine. Oh yeah, I forgot to dump off my purple gems. Alright, but yeah, I need more twigs and grass and such. I just need a lot of basic materials, actually, to be fair. Oops, probably shouldn't have swung at that pig. wonder what Wilson's doing. Oh well. Swamp is terrible? Your swamp, Dan? I, I, I don't know how long ago you sent that. I'm sorry, I haven't been reading chat. But hey, look at that. I ended up precisely where I wanted to be. Bernie the Shadow Slayer indeed. But hey, shadows aren't the only thing he slays. He can slay spiders if he wants to. He can slay whatever I need him to, as long as I'm insane. Indeed, I do like Bernie. Alright, but for now, this is sort of the, just the really boring let's gather a bunch of resources part. Because, you know... We kind of sort of need them. 
Where are you? Mm. Let's do this. Just to mess with the person. And hey, look at that. Another egg. I need to make another log suit. Otherwise this football helmet's gonna break and I'm gonna have like no emergency armor. Also, did I seriously just leave the rocks lying around despite the fact that I desperately need rocks? This guy put a trap inside Chester? Ah uh, yes, kidnapping children is my <laughs> favorite part of Don't Starve. It is, um, when you put it that way, it's a questionable act, but they're animals, right? So they don't have any rights. They're, you know, it doesn't matter if we take their children, if we do anything with them. We genetically modify them, we slaughter them, you know, stuff them in our factories and make them produce, like, crazy amounts of meat. It doesn't matter, they're animals. Also, hello, it's a spider. Uh, goodbye, that's a lot of spiders. Okay, so here's the objective, right? Get them all to aggro onto Chester. That way, I can just deal with them one at a time. Kinda genius. Except for the fact that uh, the spider warrior ended up hitting me anyway. There we go. I almost ate that monster meat. <laughs> And there we go. Alright, anyway, back to uh, gathering resources like I was. Before I was so rudely interrupted. Oh, I hope someone's back at base to get Glomer. If not, uh, that's gonna be a little depressing. Mm-hmm, mm hmm mm hmm mm hmm Oh, yeah. that guy made a drawing rack. That's why I've been gathering resources. <laughs> I'm just gonna be useless by telling him we're at picking. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Being as useless as possible. <laughs> oh, I see. This person is not even part of the lingo. To be honest, I kind of hate shorting Pig King to uh, PK. But hey, this time it ended up being funny, so... <laughs> You know what, let's go in the caves. Yeah, that sounds like a fun idea. Let's do that. We can gather some resources in there, maybe. Although, wait, Chester can't come with us, so maybe we should not go into the caves. I don't know. 
Yeah, let's not go into the caves. Inventory is kind of full right now, and Chester can't come, so. Oasis bound legs. Ooh. That's a good one. <laughs> Let's go ahead and put the carrot away. Not the carrot, I'm sorry, the purple gem. And um, we'll put the egg away too. That way I have room for carrying all this other stuff. I see him starting to go a little insane. I can fix that though with a good forest fire. Hey gobbler. Come here. Dumb idiot moron. He goops. Come here, freaking... Yeah, that's right. That's what I thought. So now I realize that I'm not playing with the most experienced group of players, and that's okay. You know? Everyone's got to start somewhere. This at least knows the basics. As it would seem, at least. Yeah, I want to try and gather, like, two stacks of twigs and grass, just... Just to have the extra... The extra punch, so to speak. Alright. Um, maybe while I'm here, I should actually grab a couple reeds from the swamp. I don't know. Do I need to? I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe I'll just ignore the swamp for now. And uh, later I can come back for reeds if I want them. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. I see my colors also starting to get washed out with the, uh, the half-sanity that I've got. I know he said he made a drying rack, but we're probably gonna need more than just one, so... You know, I'll probably be making more. No, I don't need more grass. Just need more twigs. More twigs and more rocks for sure. But none of these rocks have gold in them, so I'm just gonna kind of ignore them for now, even though I shouldn't. Because I do need more rocks. Whatever, I just want to head back now, really. <laughs> Go ahead and pick this sapling. I say probably after winter, like during spring, I'll get a boat up and uh, go sailing the seven seas. Oh, hello, Wilson with Bomber. I see we've left the monster meat just lying around on the ground. I see we leave many things lying around on the ground here, and I see a wet goop, which means, uh, someone failed using the crockpot. Not gonna point any fingers, just, you know, somebody failed using the crockpot. I don't know why these petals are in here, because they need to just go in here where they can rot. Basic farm? I prefer advanced. If we're doing farms, that is. 
most tragic part of your life is middle in the f is middle of the furry Illuminati boss fight. Your computer just gave a blue screen. Oh wow, that is unfortunate. All right, let's see here then. I need charcoal if I'm gonna make us more drying racks. So do we have charcoal lying about? Does not appear to be so. Possibly. Depends. Oh hey, speaking of another drying rack. Way to go, Wilson. You're on top of the ball game. Oh yeah, also, I should probably dump off some of the stuff that I don't need then. Uh, I guess I'll keep the chap inside a Chester. Actually, no. What what does that accomplish? It doesn't accomplish anything. Right. So I'll just go ahead and I don't know, put the trap down. Willow the cat slayer. <laughs> Bottom chest, my friend. Hey! I just saved this egg from being devoured. Wasn't that guy just sitting on the character select screen this entire time? What a weirdo. Also great, the eternal fruitcakes begin. Can I use this as fuel? No. I can use it as fertilizer if we had... No wait, no, not fertilizer. It can be eaten by pigs and stuff, and then... They can poop. That's right. That's what it's good for. Wilson, if you if you go a little higher up here, yeah, there you go, buddy. You know what? Since I am probably gonna go insane, I'll go ahead and handle some of the spider dens probably with Bernie. Also, wow, Willow's sanity can get pretty low without actually being insane. Oh, I see the eggs are overheating. Don't worry, my friend Wilson. I, I, I got us covered. Hey, he made some meaty stew for himself. Good on you. Alright, let's go ahead and try and take care of maybe some of these spiders. Oh, guess I'm not insane enough for Bernie now. <laughs> I only want to take care of the three tier ones. If they're all two tier right now, then I, I don't really actually care. Here's a three tier one. Also, yeah, I forgot. We have rocks right next to our base. Like, why do I need to worry about rocks? Alright, just need to work on getting my sanity a little lower again so that way Bernie will actually come out and help. What I need is actually just to keep some raw green caps around. I don't know why I'm tanking these hits when I can probably easily dodge them. And, you know what, while I'm at it, I need to make a log suit. As a emergency item. It remains heaven, indeed. That's why I thought this was a good base location, because we've got pigs nearby for non-webbers, but we've got spiders nearby for webbers, if, you know, webbers ever want to come here. Oh, and I see Solo Star is another willow. So here's the tier 3 nest that I'm just gonna have to take out the normal way, I guess. Also, yeah, seems like my performance is still pretty okay, so. There we go. 
easy den taken care of. Now, I don't actually know what I'm going to do with the eggs that it drops because, uh... I, I don't think I want to put them back down in this area. It could only just cause us more problems again. Uh, let's see. Do we have another tier 3 here? We do. Okay. Come on. Alright, come here, spider. I'm, I'm like one point away from being insane. There we go. Hey, Bernie. Help me out here, would you? Nice one, Bernie. And you even got the kill, so I get to keep you. Because I'm still insane. Oh, Bernie. Oh, poor Bernie. You've made a severe mistake. But I will capitalize on your mistake. And destroy this tier 3 nest while you distract every spider in existence. Oh, boy. Bernie needs saving, like ASAP. World War Three. Oh God, Bernie! Bernie, no! There's so much stuff on the ground now. Uh oh. Okay, time to emergency. Time to evacuate. I need to grab Bernie and get out of here. Oh no, that's a terror beak. Oh, this isn't good. This is not good at all. Okay, I'm out. I'm out. Peace. I'm out. See ya. Bye. Never even existed in the first place. Didn't realize we were that close to spiders, though. Alright, die, terror beak. Well, I already broke Bernie. That must be like a new speedrunning world record or something right there. Alright. Would you look at that with one shadow kill? We're already near full sanity. And for some reason, this shadow is still attacking me, despite the fact that I'm not insane. But I won't complain, because I like killing it. Alright. Well... Let's go ahead and put this away. Oh my god, please. Spiders, stop. Oh hey, there's a no idea. Man, this Wilson's going ham on the base though. Oh, you know what we still need? We still need a bird cage. That's actually a fair point. Can the spiders please stop? Every time I attack one, more come. Okay. There we go. goodness, that was too much work. But, I suppose, in a way it paid off, because now we've got a bunch of silk. Speaking of which, silk plus hound's tooth should let me make a... I need another hound's tooth. Okay, well that's unfortunate. For now, Bernie is going to have to stay broken. 
Okay, and we can put this in here, and we can just, I don't know, man, we've got too much monster meat. And just drop the rest of it here. What do we do with pumpkin? Eat it? I can't think of much better to do with a pumpkin, so... Cook. Cook. Oh. I think you can make a scarecrow. Also, I'm going to save these poor eggs. Right, so we need a birdcage. Birdcage, what does that take? Birdcage requires two papyrus and two seeds. Okay, well, here's a seed. Here's another seed. And we've got reeds in this chest. Just enough for two papyrus. And so, if we do this, then we can make the Amazing Sideshow Pirate Bird Cager Classic. I like the Amazing Sideshow. Where are you guys? Ah, the classic question of where is base? Mind if I drop that there for a sec, Wilson? I need to put down this birdcage somewhere, and back here is a favorite spot. Blommer, I need you out of the way. Okay, let's go ahead then and put it down, like, right here. Yeah, sure. Why not? Sweet, now all we need is a bird trap, which we can easily make due to our abundance of silk. Oh, and Bernie! I forgot I can actually just make more Bernie. Okay, so now we've got bird trap. Place that bad boy down. Can we attack the sacks? Uh. <laughs> Well, I don't care. Right, so what else can this base use? Um, actually, you know what? I'm gonna be selfish for a sec. And go out and grab us. Uh, go out and grab me some hound's teeth or something. I don't know. Yeah, the pierogi slash dragon pie farm does, in fact... Oh! There's a little cocoon out here. With all the bees. I do wonder how big this place is, so I'm gonna take a look. Fine, but you might die. I don't know what's up with these people. They act like, you know, a spider quarry is the end of the world. Like, I've taken down my fair share of spider queens. Just leave them. They are fine. Spiders are no big deal, my man. No big... Spiders are no big deal. I do need to worry about winter coming up, don't I? Yeah. I don't know, man. There's a certain point where, like, I just get lazy with DST and I just ignore all the things that I should be doing in favor of things I want to be doing. No.
That's actually why I like having Wilson around now. He's doing all the things I should be doing. While I'm going away and doing all the things I want to do. Which mostly involves aimlessly walking around without any real purpose. So, um, so far this direction is kind of boring. But who knows what we might find. We could find the oasis back here. Probably not, though. If I had to take a guess, this is just one big old dead end, because usually that's how the bee fields work. It's like bee field into forest into dead end. Hey, you know, it was worth a look. Now, if we're gonna want an endless amount of pierogi during the winter, we've already got great sources of meat, no doubt. Um, as far as fillers go, I mean, it's winter, so we can probably get a bunch of ice for fillers. Uh, as far as veggie goes, that's gonna be the tough one, right? What, because it's like meat, veggie... Filler and egg? Oh yeah, egg is easy because we just use meat and turn meat into egg. But the filler, or sorry, the veggies where we kind of run into a bit of an issue. Not to say that it's impossible to get veggies during the winter, but it's going to probably have to be cactus that we're going to have to get in like huge chunks. I'm going to have to go out to the desert, grab as much cactus as I can in one go, and then come back and... By the time I'm back, all the cactus is gone because I've eaten it all on the way there. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and eat some more Skittles while we let our eggs hatch. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> right, and when I get back, I need to open my present. You know what, though? I'd say I explored a pretty good chunk of the map. And I know where McTusks are nearby to the base for winter. Now that's pretty good. That way we can farm them for their uh, walking canes and camo shanters. Now if there are any beavolo out here, I would gladly slaughter them right away. Because I still need that horn. If I want to make a beefalo hat for the winter. Which I know I'm going to need because I'm Willow. So I'll actually freeze faster in the winter. <sighs> and then I need to go... Mm, I don't know. I need hounds to attack again so I can repair Bernie. If I could find the lunar islands, I could solve our winter veggie problem easily, because stone fruit bushes still grow during winter, and um, those count as a veggie, so I could easily solve our problem if I uh, knew where the lunar islands were. That's actually one of the main reasons why I like playing Woody, is because he can run on water with his goose transformation, so I can actually just early find the lunar islands. 
And hey, there's hounds. So, uh, ask and you shall be delivered. Oops, my hands weren't even on the WASD keys. Go figure. Alright. Please cook this. Eat it. Cook this. Eat it. There we go. Hey, sorry about that. My internet went off anyway. Daniel on different account. Hello, Dan. Welcome back. Just still sort of chilling. You didn't miss much. I've I'm doing a bit of exploration right now, and hounds are gonna attack again, which means I can finally get that those teeth I need to make the uh to make a repair tool for Bernie, because Bernie died in a like a spider war. I don't know if you were there for that. But there were like 50 spiders all attacking Bernie, and I tried to save him, but he died. So. And now I found, uh, I think this is like triple McTusk place, because I, I found two of them now, so there's quite a few McTusks around here, actually. This is actually pretty nice. I'll have to be sure to come here a bunch during the winter then. Tama Shanter is like the only thing I would replace my beefalo hat with, and to be honest, I don't really want to, because being insane is okay for me. I don't need to have sanity. Oh, and look at this, an accidental land bridge. Right, so I don't have enough damage output to just kill them without hiding at least once. Because my hambat is going bad. But hey, that's okay. Oh, and I see we've got more nearby tall birds. Go figure. Oh, right by Mech Tusk. That seems like an interesting thing. Uh, when winter comes around, those two will uh, probably fight each other. More children to kidnap, indeed. You know me, I'm- I, at this point, I'm just gonna have a tall bird army. But like, you know, of children. Because, uh, once they grow up, they're gonna be mean. Maybe I should just eat these eggs. You know, I've got too many of them to- I'm- I'm not a responsible enough adult. I can't, you know, take care of these children. What am I gonna do? I can barely afford to take care of myself, much alone free children of not even the same species as myself. Now, even though we do have two drying racks, honestly, I'd like to have a mass production of drying racks, like, like eight. That would be something. But as is, I don't feel like going through the work of making that many drying racks. So, you know. For now, we just got a deal. I like the three monster lasagna in the chest. Or in the ice box. Right. I see someone's been busy making food. Hope he doesn't mind if I eat these. He didn't seem to care, so... Dave has joined the game. Ooh! Ooh, wow! I'm very surprised. Very pleasantly surprised, I should say. Right, so what do I want to do next? Oh, didn't I kill those hounds and not get a single tooth? I apologize, Wilson, I didn't mean to be in this chest. Where'd all of our silk go? I assume he probably has it? Ah, yeah, here it is, okay. Don't worry, Wilson, I'll handle this.
Wow, now we've just got a bunch of junk littering our floors. Alright, and where does our flint go? Does it go in here? Oh, it does, but... Dang it, that chest is just too full. Oh, hey, check this out. Boom. Just saved us a bunch of space. You know what? I'm actually going to go out and grab some niter, so that way maybe we can send a signal to someone. Be like, hey, here's where we are. Although, this is a slow process. This is the poor man's way to mine at night. How's the connection? Seems okay. Though I thought we had more people than this. Alright, let's go ahead then and set off another flare, so that way people know where we are. Reworks Tallbird pet. <laughs> that would be interesting to see if Clay would do that. Oh, that's too hot. Alright, let's see here now. This needs to go in there. This needs to go in here. The uniter can go, I don't know, just on the floor, I guess, with the flint. Butterfly wings. Okay, so we've got a tier 3 nest right there. I might want to take care of that one, just so that way we don't keep having these spiders, like, right in our face. I feel like maybe we need more chests. I'm guilty of just throwing things on the floor instead of putting things in chests. Oh. Okay, game. Please don't have a seizure now. Nice one, Wilson. Um... Alright, let's go ahead and make another football helmet. There we go. Down we go. Alright, now there should just be, yep, a singular spider warrior, and after this, this nest can be destroyed. Found a ginger pig. Right. I don't know what to say to that. I mean, chase it, I guess? <laughs> I'm not actually gonna say that, though. You know what? If we have so much extra monster meat, why don't I just give it to the pigs, you know? Let's go ahead and make another chest, because we desperately need it, I would say, treasured chest. Right, so now we can start storing some of this other stuff that's kind of important, I guess. Except, hold on, why am I putting that away? There we go. You mostly just put rocks and stuff and other living things can eat on the chest and other stuff on the floor. Yeah, yeah. That's the smart way to do it. Just put the stuff that can be eaten 
in the chests and everything else goes on the floor because who needs everything else, right? Let's go ahead and cook this green cap. That should help just a little bit. To stave off insanity. Once it turns day, I might turn a couple pigs into were pigs, but oh, you know what? I really do desperately need to focus on beefalo. So let's actually make, before I leave, let's make a shaving tool because I'm not gonna just murder them all for the wool. I'm gonna shave them. So where's our flint at? Uh, I assume he put the extra flint somewhere. Or maybe not. Whatever, I'll just use this flint then, I guess. Make us a razor. Alright, now off we go to shave beefalo. Just gotta follow this path up. Actually, I kind of want to complete my outline of this place, so let's go ahead and take the long detour way up. And we can grab some meat on the way. I like using the lighter just as a as a fire to can uh, to cook food. Sorry. <laughs> Guess I'm just having a bit of a brain fart right now. Hey, here's a dead guy. Wonder what he had on him. Because whatever it was, it's gone now. Alright, there we go. Sweet. Outline of this place complete. And so now, back to beefalo. There were beefalo here, right? If I'm not mistaken. There are at least some... I know there were some over to the right. I want to see if there are some over here to the left. Because there could be. There could also not be. Alright, cool. There's just not any, I guess. So I'm going to quickly head back over to the right so that way I can shave them. Oh, here's one at least. Oh, here's, here's sort of part of the herd. Shave, shave, and shave. Okay, yeah, let's keep looking around. I can hear him. I hear poop. But I hear beefalo. Here they are. Wow, this is a whole bunch of them, actually. No, don't shave this one. There we go. <coughs> Apologize for the cough. Okay, there should be more over this way. Like how I got my poor little lighter. Oh, I can hear him. Yeah, here we go. I feel like I've seen a lot of these names before already. What is this guy? He's Weber. Oh, and we've got a freaking Barley coming up too. Alright. The initial lag spike is over. Let's go ahead and collect all this wool. I'll worry about killing them after I've picked up everything. I just well grab manure too. Beefa look so sad now. 
they're all naked and sad and brain rot. Mm, I don't know, man. I don't know. I I don't. I do not worry about what people say. The title should be "Being a Terrible Hairdresser on Don't Starve Together." Oh yeah. <laughs> I don't even do a good job of shaving them. I leave, like, just patches of hair all over them. But somehow I don't manage to wake them up while shaving them, which is pretty impressive. Alright, so I think that should be all the shavings. So let's go ahead and try and get one to follow me and get murdered into some horn stuff. Oh, that's that's another herd over there, isn't it? Right, well. Okay, let's hope this is far away enough. Okay, this should definitely be... Oh, no, 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 I actually got closer to other beefalo. Four, five, four. There we go. One, two, three, four, five. Four. There we go. Yeah, oh! Okay, whatever. I took one hit, so... But... Let's go ahead and cook some of this, because I'm hungry. Wonder how many beef flow are right here, because if it's just the one, then I'll just murder it. Nope, it's a... It's a small-sized herd. But you know what? This guy's far away enough. I bet you if I lure him away, then uh, he'll be far, far, far away. And then I can just murder him. Hey, buddy. And don't worry, I'll make sure there's still plenty of beef flow left for them to mate and stuff. I just need to get myself a horn, that's all. And they're being too stubborn about it. I just want a horn, please. Just drop a horn. Here's the other beef flow I shave. Well, on the bright side, I suppose I've got some extra materials for anyone back at base who might want them. Alright, let's go ahead and give you a good whack. Alright. Oh, come on. Hey, and there's the horn. Right, okay, I'm done now. I can head back to base, stop murdering these beefalo. So I'm all situated for winter, pretty much. Got my beeflow hat on the ready, and I'm sure we've got plenty of supplies to make a thermal stone when it comes to it. Unfortunately, Bernie's still broken, so I can't really hold him for warmth, but, you know, whatever. Also, why are we growing- why are we doing small jerky? We've got plenty of extra meat. I don't understand. Why are we making small jerky? Big King Hat, classic. We'll go with Big King Hat, please. Alright, Chester. Got another item for you to store. Alright, and now we've got way more beeflow wool. Look at that. Oh, I see, we have an extra razor. <laughs> Oops. Let's see, what else is there that I can just sort of help clear clutter with? Yeah. Ah. Alright, whatever. Good enough. Also, maybe let's put Glomer's flower right here.
Uh, you know what? I might just make a thermal stone right now and just put it inside Chester if that will protect it from, like, you know, being ruined and stuff. So to make a thermal stone, I need... what is it? Flint and a pickaxe, I think. So where's our flint? Right here. I think I need three. Three flint should make me a thermal stone. And then if we just put that inside Chester, hopefully it won't get warm and lose durability. Alright, when day comes around, I'm gonna transform our pigs into were pigs and whatnot, and then, uh... When, uh... And then after that, I think I'm gonna try and go to the dragonfly desert real quick. Grab us as much cactus as I can, as well as, uh... I don't know, some other stuff. Oh, you know what? I'm hungry. Let's go ahead and make some food. You know what? I can actually just eat this small jerky. Nice shovel weaponry. Uh, I need to... Sorry, Wilson, I'm making something right now. You can use that. Wait, there's children? Where's the children? Oh no, my eggs! I just realized, I think I left them on the ground somewhere. I think I left them on the ground, like, right here on the mini-map. They're probably dead by now. Ah, boy. Boy, oh boy. Spoiled carrots, huh? You're just gonna let that turn into rot? Fair enough. Alright, well, I'm gonna stick to the plan. Ignore the fact that we've lost a, f a fallen, a good member. Fallen in combat. And let's just get some pigs. I think I had enough to transform three pigs, so... And this one should start to transform. Alright. That was pretty easy. I'm doing this for the pig skin because I desperately need it. HP. Hmm, that's rough. Hey pig, you wanna come with me? Yeah, you follow, that's what I thought. We'll go ahead and dry one of these. Wilson, you're all decked out. I need the pig to follow me real quick because I want to transform him. And in order to do so, I just need like two more pieces of monster meat. Hey, bud. Okay, you know what? I tried to make the were pig fight the spiders. It didn't work out. And instead, now all I have is a broken football helmet. Can I make pierogi? I don't think so. I don't think I have a vegetable. Although, wait, what's growing in the farm right now? Asparagus? 
sure. That probably works. Give me a meat. An egg, sorry. Not a meat. So, egg, vegetable, meat, and then I will just use one of these as the filler, probably. I actually don't know if we have more food than what's in this icebox. Oh, we do. Huh. Go figure. I'm just stupid. Sorry. Uh, let's go ahead then. Although, no. If I'm making pierogies, it would be a waste to just... You know. Do that. Go ahead and cook that. Boom. What do you keep eating, Wilson? I find it disturbing that every time you take a bite of something, you go, I don't feel so good. There we go. That's some good eating right there. And you know what? Before I go on my grand adventure, I'm going to take this honey ham with me. Alright, off to the dragonfly desert in order to, uh, I don't know, do something, I think? Which, if I'm going off to the dragonfly desert, it's way faster if I just jump through this wormhole. So Chester, have you been keeping my thermal stone at neutral temperature? You have not, you, you dang liar. You heathen. You're gonna waste my thermal stone durability. And words? What? Alright. Uh, looks like a meteor storm's hit this area. And hey, while we're on our way to the Dragonfly Desert, I suppose it wouldn't hurt to kidnap a child. Oh, there's no child to kidnap. Never mind. See you later. Hmm. Are you seriously still ch- what, what, what do you want from me? Why are you so persistent? I've done nothing. I don't understand, Talbert. I don't have a, your child. Why are you still chasing me? You need to go back to your nest. What if your actual child gets stolen? The one that you don't have right now because for some reason you didn't lay an egg. You gonna go to sleep maybe, huh? It's nighttime. You might be tired. You might want to go to sleep. Alright, because I'm heading to the desert, I'm just gonna use my lighter and the map to get there. I do need to figure out what this wormhole goes to. Also, poor man. Red's dead. <laughs> okay, I need to get these hounds off my tail ASAP. No, come on, hound. Oh, Freddy's new. Hey, we, we've got a full six players now. And it's about to turn winter. How exciting. Can someone help you? Well, if I were nearby, I could, but no. <laughs> As it stands, I'm picking cactus. And I probably will be for a very long time.
if Winter doesn't get me. Right. <laughs> I have not seen a single player at all. Like, all game. Besides Wilson. So, I'm just very confused. Very confounded as to where everyone is. Hey, Hound, you maybe want to screw off? Well, you didn't even drop a tooth. How useless. Hmm, there we go. That healed me up quite nicely. That was just bones. I'm hoping for a hound's tooth so I can finally repair Bernie. Winter tomorrow. Yeah. Go figure. Uh. I know cactus can grow during the winter. But you can't move cactus, so that's just unfortunate. If you could dig up a cactus and move it, I'd have a cactus farm at every base of mine. Because it's just an amazing superfood. It does hurt to pick, but like, it gives you sanity and, you know, hunger, and it's a vegetable that grows during the winter. It's kind of amazing. Oh boy. Well, looks like I've nearly picked every single cactus I can. But I will not stop until I uh, return with a hound's tooth to repair Bernie. I'm probably actually going to end this stream whenever we kill Deerclops because, to be honest, I'm not feeling real motivated to continue on with this world. Not that anything is particularly bad about it, it's just that, you know, I thought this morning when I woke up, I would like, I'm bored, let's do some DST and let's stream it because why not? And, uh, well then that hairdresser interrupted and, you know, after a little while, you just kind of get bored of the whole process, there's nothing interesting is happening, you know. Because this isn't about any sort of new content, like with Wirt, how I had a super goal in mind and stuff, I just kind of don't know what to do. But hey, Deerclops is still a good while away, you know, so... I'm guaranteeing at least I didn't just waste everyone's time, you know? I want to make sure it was all worth it. Furry Illuminati? Uh, well, I guess so, because he's got one eye, right? So, yeah, I guess he's kind of Illuminati. Maybe I should consider doing Twitch instead of YouTube. I don't know, I like YouTube because it just automatically archives the streams into videos and stuff. But Twitch, I could also have the drops enabled, so that way when people actually watch me, they can also still get the Don't Starve Together drops instead of just, you know, not getting anything. Plus, you know, live streaming is just generally better on Twitch than it is on YouTube, so I don't know. Maybe I should, but I don't know. I'm comfortable with YouTube, I guess. So, like, why would I want to swap over to something else? Okay, let's go ahead then and get a couple hounds. Right. Please, attack the hound, Willow. Hey, there's our tooth. Okay, we can leave now. Alright, let's get out of here and let's head back home. 28 cactus isn't a bad haul. 
And let's see what this wormhole takes us. Hopefully closer to home and not further away. Oh, hey. Oh, would you look at that? It did take us closer to home. That's a pretty nice wormhole to know about that. Please. Willow, why aren't you walking when I tell you to? Thank you. My goodness. How do you stop being a ghost? Uh, good question. <laughs> and Dave, with the great answer, that is not at all helpful to someone who doesn't know how to play this game. I was wondering why I was going insane so quickly. I forgot. Uh, he didn't leave when he died. Like most people do. Which is weird, because no one here is being helpful or even social in any aspect. He's just, just, I don't know, he thought it was cool to stick around, I guess. A glomer and also a big warm campfire. I like the both of you, so I'm going to stand right here and get my sanity to go up incredibly quickly. Alright, now where's our other hound's tooth? Here it is, and where's our silk at? Here it is, so... Here's this sewing kit, and we can put this back, and we can sew Bernie right up to 100% with one use of the good old sewing kit. Alright, and I'll go ahead and store the cactus right in here. Okay, so, um, maybe I should turn this two bad meat into eggs. Egg. Egg. Now we've got an egg in each one of these. We got a meat here and a... Oh, oh, hold on. Sorry, Wilson. This is all my fault, and yet I'm making you chase them all away. Chester's now glowing because he's, uh, he's warm. Hey, Terby, screw off. All right, man. I don't have to deal with your garbage. Uh, where does our nightmare fuel go? I think it goes in this chest, right? Bernie, you you good? Yeah. Uh, Wilson, can I use this icebox thing? Okay. Filler, good, and then vegetable. Oh, I don't know where the meat went. I guess he took it all, huh? Boom. Emergency meat to grass. Uh, I have my personal stack of 40, but I don't really want to dig into that for this time. You ordered pizza? What kind of pizza did you get, Dan? Here, have some grass, my amigo. That's all I can really afford to give. I mean, that's half of mine, so should be good enough. You know, I'm curious, actually. Does this Wilson seems to actually understand what I'm saying? Like, I'm curious if he's watching the stream. I haven't actually been like typing at all to him and yet half the time he he just sort of like knows. Also, why did I make another pierogi? I was actually already at like full health. I don't know, I'm dumb. 
see. Did he put the jerky back in this box? Because if this is the jerky box, then that's fine with me. I just need to know. Ah, uh, whatever. I see that we're kind of short on food, actually. Um, that's something. You know what, just for the sake of it, let's go ahead and finish exploring this rock biome. Because, you know, I'm a weirdo who thinks that should be my top priority right now. Pepperoni pizza? Oh, well, that's nice. I'm a meat lover's type of guy, but, you know, plain old pepperoni, you can't go anything. You can't go wrong with that, you know? <laughs> Maybe I should try and get started in the magic stuff. We've got some nightmare fuel. So maybe I should try and get started on, like, the, the Prestahatitator and the Shadow Manipulator. I like how several times I've done a flare right on our base so that way people can come find us, and yet nobody has come for us. So that's something. In fact, you know what? Just just because I feel like doing it again, let's go ahead and do it again. Let's go ahead and light a flare right where our base practically is. Sure, it's a little off, but whatever. Boom. Now people should know where our base is. Plain and simple. Oh, hi! Hello, Wormwood. I didn't even know we had a Wormwood in the lobby. Hopefully you're okay, Wormwood. <laughs> Welcome to home sweet home. Oh, thank you, Wormwood. I don't desperately need the assistance, but it is always nice. Oh, my poor boy, stop taking damage. You desperately need whatever health you can eat. I'm gonna eat this. My poor Wormwoody boy. Oh, thank you, my friend. But I want to be insane. I like having Bernie out and about. I see, my Thermal Stone has lost durability being inside of Chester, and that is unfortunate. Oh! Well, Wormwood found our base, and he decided he was so fed up with it, he would just leave immediately. Okay. <laughs>
Also, I was surprised to see a bit of a forest down there. But I guess that does sort of happen with spider quarries from time to time. Do we not have rot to fertilize this stuff, my dude? Yeah, we've got 40 rot, my man. Here, I'll let him know. There we go. Hands are taken care of. Oh my gosh. I see. He's got an absurd amount of rot. Also, are you a controller player? Do you use controller? I know I can hold Bernie for a little bit of, uh, warmth. I wonder if Mac Tusk is already in, because if so, I should get going then. Wilson's making a whole bunch of weirdo stuff. Welcome back, Dan. Oh, you need to go? Oh, sorry, uh... Sir with the Waluigi profile, he needed to go. I'll, I'll try and kidnap a small bird in his honor. Alright, let's go ahead and see. Where is Mac Tusk? They're right over there. Wanna come help kill Mac Tusk? Wanna come help kill Mac Tusk? Didn't even mean to put the double question marks, but whatever. Alright, sweet, let's go. Once he's ready. Yeah, let's go, Wilson. Maybe I should have brought some food, but. Oh, I see my performance is bad. Probably because of the bees. Oh, I'm so sorry. Keep chasing him. Oh, I see the problem. Well, as stated before, I thought this would be interesting. Hey, and it's a Tama Shanter. We'll let Wilson take that one. Hey, Wilson! Wilson! Wilson, here. Wilson, do you want this? You should have that. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna grab- Ow! Okay, that was bad. Okay. Now there's another guy over here. So let's try and kill him.
Man, I'm actually near death. Gonna have to make some pierogies when we get home. Uh, no. Ah, nothing good. Okay. That's unfortunate. <laughs> also, sorry to see that you have a cold, uh, Dan. Hello, Wilson. I don't know if, uh, if there's anything else further down here that we need to get. There's, uh, there's one more guy down here, I guess. If we want to go get him, which it seems like you are joining me, so... Alright, he's, like, down here. Oh. I don't have it set to endless, so he can't revive at the gate. Your real name is Evie. Is it really? Alright, here we are. Just keep chasing Mac Tusk and eventually he'll stop running. You're a Pokemon. Hmm. Ah, dang. All we got was one Tamashanter. Well, thanks. But we didn't get anything good, really, except for that Tam. I just need to grab the uh, backpack and we can leave. Alright. Let's go ahead and hold Bernie right now for some warmth. Now all we need to do is just run on back to base. Uh, you know what? I'll make us a nice campfire. You okay there, Wilson? <laughs> Let's start hatching this egg. I actually need some grass, so... Might as well grab some while we're here. just started snowing too. <laughs> and now someone else just died to darkness. Let's see if they leave. Oh, they were a Maxwell. Wilson and I, we're dedicated. We're the only two who've, who've toughed it out, you know. Alright, let's go ahead and grab this. Oh, well, Merry Christmas to you too, Dan. Alright, we can just walk home from here. Now that we're home, I need to make myself some gosh dang pierogies, because otherwise I'm gonna die. Actually, I'll even eat this small turkey. I'll eat this large turkey as well. I'll put this on the drying rack. 
All right, and let's go ahead and put one, two. Oh, I need an egg, and then I need a filler, which I'm gonna use this as a filler. So once I just do this, then I can do that, and one of this, and give this to the bird, and the bird will give me an egg, and then I can just make pierogi. What do we need for a tree? I've been ignoring the tree for far too long. What do we need for a tree? If we want a Christmas tree, we need two manure and a plank. Alright, I can do that. Two manure and a plank should be pretty easy. So let's go and grab some manure. And we can get started growing a Christmas tree, because I uh, completely forgot about that. And it's kind of an important thing. Man, Willow does freeze faster. Like, I just left the campfire and my thermal stone's already yellow. I'm even holding Bernie, too, to try and help. Alright, I just need some manure, so wherever the bee flow are... Oh, they're in heat. Oh, but I have the bee flow hat on, so I'm perfectly fine. Yeah, that's right. Bow down to me. Or, you know, just ignore me, so that way I don't get hurt a bunch. By an entire angry horde of... Beefalo. And now starts the harsh survival of winter. <laughs> We've got, what, eight days till dragonfly? Or not dragonfly, sorry. Deer clops? Mm, we'll be fine. We'll probably be okay. I've got Bernie after all. As long as I have Bernie, Deer Clops is going to be a piece of cake. Hello, I am back. And I'm here to build us a nice little Christmas tree. I, um... Need some stuff. Where's the stuff I need? I need stuff. Uh, where... What do I need? I need pine cones. That's what it is. So, where's the pine cones at? Man, everything's sort of just hodgepodge all over the place here. None of these chests have any form of organization whatsoever. Do we not have pine cones? I guess I'll cut down one of these trees then. Plant one back into the ground and the other into our nice little Christmas tree. I don't care. Am I down? <laughs> right, so let's see. Can we make this stuff? Yeah, we could make that stuff. Sure enough, we could make that stuff. What takes us like one of these bad boys and. Uh, we got everything we could possibly ever need, right here. Except for not really. Please. Uh, boy. 
I need this for a plank, I guess. And I need one of these, and then I need to go out and grab us some marble from this bad boy. I don't know what to do with the extra marble, but... Here we go, and we can make one of these, and one of these. And put this away, I guess. Oops, sorry. Uh, why does this have, like, a weird little radius around? Sure, let's go ahead and put it here. And then we can build our furnace, our little masonry oven, right here. Oh yeah, I forgot, we need holiday cheer for any of this, huh? Or whatever. Oh, got ourselves a nice little wardrobe too. You know what, because it's winter, why not change into my nice little winter outfit? Once Wilson is done. Hmm. All right, let's go ahead and change into my winter outfit. Here's my preset winter outfit confirmed. Alright, let's actually get back to work. Egg, you're coming with me. We're gonna get back to trying to explore the rest of the down here. I actually really like this winter outfit. I haven't used it at all because I've always liked her gorge outfit way more. But this is still pretty nice. So I see rock biome for ages is what's below our base. Hey, the oasis is below our base. That's a much closer source of cactus if we need vegetables. And here's even more gears. Wow, this world is a great world for anyone who likes WX because there's so many gears. Like, there's gears like crazy. Mm -hmm. Now, I could pick this cactus, but honestly, we still have plenty at home, so. I'm just gonna keep exploring. Mm hmm. Oh, and here's the oasis itself. Oop, ow. My game. Oop, sorry, I didn't mean to bring up console command. I was just trying to press tab to see if I, uh, was, like, murdering anyone with my bad internet. With my laggy game. You know what? Nah. I'm not gonna let my durability go to waste, so I'm just gonna do this. Oh! Willow has a custom idle animation if she's holding Bernie. I never knew that. Oh, it's like how Woody's custom idle animation only works if he's holding Lucy. Willow has one for if she's holding Bernie. Am I actually overheating? Because if so, that's pretty cool. All right. Now we know we can explore and not have to worry about our temperature for a while, because I'm actually hot. I'm still dying of heat. 
despite the fact that it's winter and I'm not even close to the source of fire anymore. Alright, there we go. I stopped dying. <laughs> Who knew that uh, standing directly inside of a forest fire actually makes you really, really hot? Oh, I know you're hungry, Willow. Don't worry about it. We'll fix it when we get back to the base. Which should be soon. Wow, how am I still retaining this heat? It's like, Willow should be getting cold by now. Alright, well, there goes the, the little heat waves they've dispersed, so... But I'll keep that in mind now for the future. If I'm ever getting cold, just burn down a tree and stand right inside of it. Oh, is this where the Wormwood came from? He went into a sinkhole somewhere else, came out of this sinkhole, and then started coming up toward our base? Because that's the only way, really, he could have missed our base. Also, my goodness, even more gears! This is absurd! How many people we got? We, it's still just me and Wilson, you know, the classic crew. If I could, I'd make my buddy Wilson a map scroll so that way he knows, like, what the map is like. Because he probably hasn't explored nearly as much as I have. I think he's sort of just kind of stayed back at the base like a responsible human being. Whereas I'm just doing nothing, walking. But hey, that's a pretty impressive amount of the map explored, though. Alright, let's keep moving. Hello, Wilson. I wasn't super expecting to see you back here. Hey, another winner's feast chest. Hmm. Let's go ahead and keep hatching this egg, I suppose. Uh, we running low on food, Wilson? You gotta tell me these things. I can't just predict the future. Why is it all in different ice boxes? Please, I need it to just be in one centralized ice box. Otherwise, I can't tell what food we have. Alright, I'll get some more monster meat and then transform some more pigs into were pigs so we can get some more regular meat. Willow just doesn't want to move, I guess. Well... Sometimes... I do. Guess not this time. If we had a worm wood, we probably would need it. Plus, there's... Keep them. We have plenty of gears anyway. At least I can go get some. Mm 
sure thing. Alright, I guess we'll go to the closest source of gears I know, which is down here. And here. Just casually ignoring the spiders. Oh shoot, I accidentally pressed caps lock. Oh, my armor's not even on. Oops, I think it broke. Or did I just not equip it because I'm dumb? No, it broke. Okay, fair enough. So I'm not dumb. Uh, yeah, here's the other one. Okay, got it. Easy. You don't want to grab these other gears? Whatever. Fine. I'll hold them. Guess there's some more clockworks down this way if you want to get some more gears. Because, hey, why not? You know? And then maybe tomorrow I'll go back to Mac Tusk and see what we've got. Hey Wilson, you should put on some armor. There we go. Well, that's all the close ones. All the close ones. I do actually want to know where this wormhole goes, so I'm just going to jump right in. Hmm. Guess we could go to the swamp. I don't know. I need to head back to base, actually. I'm kind of like just dying. Yeah, I'm gonna just head back to base. I'm dying. Though I do need some grass, so I will pick grass. Right. Sorry I've been so quiet, you know, this is sort of the the time and don't starve together where things just tone down and uh, not much goes on, you know? Just kinda plain, simple, don't starve together. Not much happening here. I'm gonna go ahead and light this bad boy. Again, dance.
I just can't wait for the deer claps to get here so I can get off and do something else. Technically, I don't have to wait for the deer claps, but you know, I feel like I owe Wilson something. Gotta give him some sort of closure, some sort of grand finale, if you will. So... Away we go. Oh! Well, would you look at this? Huh. Well, that's certainly interesting. I don't know. Is, is there anything of use on this guy? Not really, in my personal opinion. I like the crockpot, though. Maybe I should give my beef low hat a bit of a break. Wow, this hand came from far out. I know you're hungry, Willow. Just hold on. Like two seconds. Oh. Thanks. I was just gonna eat something when I got back to base, but... If you wanna stuff something down my throat. <laughs> and who knows, maybe we'll get this egg to hatch by then. Just sit directly in the fire. You didn't start the fire. Mm, boy. Ah man, what what's what a bunch of stuff in in here, huh? Actually, I want this berry bush. The rest of this stuff, you know, whatever he can keep in there, I guess, if he wants to. to take the egg and get on out of here. Alright, let's let's grab some ice. We can always use this back at home. Oh, I see Wilson must have forgotten something. <laughs> what is it, my dude? You good? Alright, looks like you're good. It's finally here. What is? Oh, the pizza. dinner tonight I'm having taquitos whenever uh, whenever those get made so no pizza for me but I prefer taquitos anyway And we're back home, where I can hopefully make some food, so I don't die. Oh, 
Let's just have a nice little decorative crock pot. And uh, uh, if I make a rope, I can make a berry bush hat. Oh, I also need a straw hat. You gotta be kidding me, man. Is this so absurd? Okay. Make this. Then you can make this. <laughs> Did I accidentally make an extra straw hat? I don't know. Hmm. All right, and let's see here. Uh, I uh, I still need food, so what I'm gonna do is, hey, you, come here. Neither one of you dropped meat of the spider. Thank you, this is what I need. Alright, give me egg. Okay, so egg, meat. Oops. Uh, you making something, my buddy? Hey, no, no, no. None of that required. Now we eat like king. We... Alright, go ahead and harvest this, then I should get some of my HP back. Is your HP? What is your HP? What is your HP? 86? Hmm. Okay. Can I get some easy spider spoot speeder spot speeder mitt? Nope, that was not a, a monster meat. I wanted a monster meat. I did not get a monster meat. Okay, here we go. There we go. Now Wilson's hunger should be nice and satisfied. Actually, you know what? I think I left a monster meat down here. Yeah, let's go ahead and pick this up from meatballs. Because I still need uh, hunger. Even if I don't need HP all that badly, I still need hunger. So let's go ahead and do this. Wooden flooring? Sure. Also, hounds are incoming, my man. Maybe uh, we should be a bit more cautious of that.
I see we still need to put up some meat. Again. Yeah, I was gonna say, I thought I heard hounds, so where are they? Whatever happened to our eternal fruitcake? I don't know. I don't know, man. I don't know. I'm told someone here is getting old. Alright, let's move this egg. Come on already. Hounds, I'm waiting for ya. And sweet, I can use this monster meat to transform some pigs because I'm kinda low on pig skin. Yeah, we can use that. <laughs> Hello, pigs. Hello, my big brothers. One more should do the trick. Easy. That was rude. Why did you hit me? Come on, man. I thought we were chill. I thought we were homies, but I guess not. I guess, you know, we were not cool or whatever. I don't, I don't know, man. I don't know. I just, I don't know. That I knew you. <laughs> Sorry. I'm starting to lose my mind. Real life. It's starting to make me go a little cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. Alright, let's see here. Don't we have some marble put away somewhere? We do. Let's go ahead and make some marble beans. Why? Because I can. Hello, my Wilson amigo. Mind if I plant a couple of marble beans in our forest? Honestly, I could relax here for the rest of the game until Deer Clops shows up. Just not do anything. That sounds nice. Oh boy, where did our silk go? Here it is. Don't ask me why it's there. Just, it's, it's there. It's in pur purpose. Oh, I see he's starting on the wooded flooring. What's it take to make carpet flooring? Isn't it just wood flooring plus beeflo wool? Or carpet flooring? Carpeted flooring is not wooded flooring plus beeflo wool, which is unfortunate. Hmm. Alright, let's see then. What do we got there? Oh, it's the wormwood! Oh, hey! Let's 
spider ate the egg. Oh no. I see we sort of have some reinforcements, I guess. Oh no, man. Okay, don't use Bernie as a weapon. It actually makes him degrade even faster. Which is understood. Help yourself. A spare. You got a spare hat. on the ground. Oh, what a team. Who knew the Wormwood would be coming back? I certainly didn't. Oh man, I don't even need the Tam O'Shanter. My Sanity regen is just insane with a full campfire, Bernie, and Glomer. Though I'm gonna need some green caps to go insane once Deerclops shows up. Nice stuff. I like his looks. He's got the skins. Face palm, arrow. <sighs> I know, this is just the most entertaining thing in the world, isn't it? Hey, I'm right there with you. If you're bored out of your mind watching this, I'm bored out of my mind playing this. But as stated before, we do it for the good of Wilson. And now, for the good of, uh, what's his name? Wormwood. Yeah, Wormwood. <laughs> Oh, he's even got a little doggy backpack. He's got a hound backpack. Whereas I have the dragonfly backpack. I've had this dragonfly backpack forever. It was like my first ever legendary drop. I think that's the tier anyway, legendary or something. I don't know. But yeah, I got that like way back when I first started playing DST. I, I, uh got this dragonfly backpack and I was like, ah, oh, sick, that's amazing. And then I never got anything cool after that for like, ever. And now look at me. Here I am still using the same backpack, you know, 600 hours later. <laughs> anyway, let's try and be productive. So what does faking productivity look like? Uh, first, we walk away from the base to make it seem as if we're doing something. But in reality, we're doing nothing. I mean, I guess I can kill some cacoons, get us some meat. Some much needed meat, mind you. <laughs> I kept stranger things than that. Alright, Willow. Slow your roll there, buddy. Calm it down just a notch. Could go underground just to like fake productivity under there. Um, let's go ahead. You know what? For, for, for the goofs and gaffs, let's just kill a regular pig. 
Oh, sure, let's kill another regular pig. Stupid pig. I like how for some reason they have like all the characters have like default like attack um quotes. But pigs and spiders get their own unique attack quotes for every character. Which is uh you know, just a nice touch, I guess. But it's also kind of strange that they chose those two things to get their own unique attack quotes. I kind of understand the spiders. They're like the, uh, the common foundation of enemy for a don't starve. But the pigs? I mean, people don't even attack pigs all that often. So it's just weird. Ah, here's the cat room. I was looking for you. Hey, look, I'm not fake, faking productivity, I'm actually being productive. I've gotten us a bunch of meat. Five meat to be precise. So, would you look at that? Wonder what happened to the wormwood. Wonder what's in his backpack. Oh, nothing. A bigger. All right, let's look around for some green caps, because I'm going to need those if I want to go insane. Also, it looks like the Wilson could use some help out here, so I'm going to dig up these stumps for him. Because apparently he doesn't know you use a shovel to dig out stumps. But hey, that's cool. It's whatever. I don't care. Live the way you want. Unless you're a Kakoon, in which case I'm going to kill you. <laughs> Man, they respawned fast. Hey, Mole Worm, you want to come out? Yeah, that's what I thought. Ooh, now Krampus is starting to get a little upset. I haven't killed a Krampus in a while be super cool to get his um, Krampus sack to drop right away, but I uh, highly doubt that'll happen. Due to various reasons. Anyone got grass? Not really. Let's just tell a bold-faced lie to the Wilson, so that way I don't have to give away my 33 grass. Please, spiders, I want to kill you. Why are you not aggro? Hello, spider. Oh, and you just so happen to be right next to a green cap. The very thing I said I needed in order to uh, go insane. Don't eat the sugar cane. I know the temptation was there to just immediately devour that, but we need it for the Christmas tree that I'm not even going to end up using before Deerclops arrives. But, you know, you get the point. Might as well at least pretend I care about the Christmas tree. Is Will Wilson, is he following me? He might be following me, but I'm just looking for green caps, my man. Like, there's nothing too special going on here. I'm just... I need at least two of these in order to guarantee my insanity. Is the Wormwood still here? He is. I haven't seen him. You think he left? You think he's not gonna chill with us? I hope the deer claps doesn't spawn on poor old Wormwood. I wanna just kill it. Unequip Bernie, unequip Bernie. Equip Bernie.
guess we can just walk back to the base now. Where is the base exactly? Oh, it's, yeah, it's like right down here. It's right down here. Oh, hi, Wormwood. I was just talking about how I have not seen you in like ages. Put the sugar cookie up on the tree. I'll heal off of your efforts. I could use a bit of nom nom myself, so let's go ahead and make a crock pot meal. And I knew having multiple crockpots would come in handy. Oh boy, looks like we still need more meat. I get grass. Okay. Thank you, comrade, for get grass. <laughs> oh boy. That's my cue to get out of here. Also, maybe I want to just keep some glamour goop on me instead of these green caps, because the goop can be used to put me practically insane right away, I think. I don't know. Man, I don't know. Hello, pig. You want good food? Good, because I am here to give you good food. Sweet. Flawless victory. <laughs> Who knew playing as Willow was so easy? Alright, I guess we can try and get more monster meat. What are you guys doing? Are you supposed to, like, be in a... Nest. And look at that. I'm practically full health now. Yeah, I might as well just farm some monster meat for the pals back at the base. That way we've got fresh food supplies and no one can complain. Hey, I wonder if we can put plum pudding on the Christmas tree. They won't let me. Well, I tried, so... Hey, a jet black feather. You know what that means. I can actually make a cartographer's desk, probably. No, I still need papyrus, and I don't have enough. Whatever. All right, what's it make to take? A, what's it take to make a cartographer's desk? I think that's under science. My mistake. Four planks and a compass. Well, here's one, two, three, and four. 
Now we just need a compass under the survival tab, which I just need a flint for if I want to make a compass. So to make compass, I need a flint. Where is where in the world is the flint? Is the flint. Oh, I see. My my brother here is trying to hatch another egg. All right, and Babushka, we've got a cartographer's desk. Now, if we just put that bad boy, I don't know, like here. Now, all I need is a jet feather and a papyrus to make a map scroll, which is something. Mm -hmm. Oh! Wow! Uh, yeah, I need the papyrus bad, though. So, luckily, we've got this wormhole that'll take us right to the swap. I'll have to burn these clothes. <laughs> destination. As long as I am kept warm by Bernie and my hat, I do not need to worry about light. That being said, my warmth seems to be running quickly out. Ooh, suspicious boulder. I know you. You're a cool thing. And a great map marker for if anyone were to join, but no one's going to join now, because it's winter. Please don't punch me at all, any of you. Oh, you're, you're gonna, you're gonna punch me now. I can just taste it in your breath. You want to punch me. Please no tentacle spanks. I could really go without a tentacle spanking right now. Alright, back to base. Back to the base. Back to the base. Just gonna wait till Deer Clops shows up. I realize now I'm short on logs, so maybe I should get some. Yeah, I guess I can do that. Indie Soup 103 has joined the game. Okay, what a weird weirdo. Oh, they. Oh, I'm so sorry. I just let that spider eat the egg because I had to protect the fire. Okay. Boom, heyo. Hit him with the heyo, he won't even know what to do in response. Oh, shoot. Wait, I need to make this into a freaking this, which needs a charcoal. Do we have a charcoal? Do, do people have charcoal? I guess we don't have charcoal. That's fine. That's fine. That's no, that's that's fine. That's, that's fine. I didn't need it anyway. Do we have a charcoal? No, I don't think so. No, I don't think so. Alright, fine. I'll go get my own charcoal. 
I'm an adult now. I can do that. <laughs> I'm not actually, but you know. I'm a big boy. I, I can do it. I can get my own truck. I'm sure Wilson has seen me dig up enough stumps to know that you can dig up the stumps. Alright, now I'm just waiting for this to, uh, give me charcoal. Ooh, ouch. I'm burning alive. Oochie, ouchie. There we go. And hey, look at that. Please come get me, I'm gonna die. Nothing to burn here. <laughs> and you know what? I'll just leave this map scroll on the ground in case if anyone ever wants it. I don't know who needs the map scroll more, Wilson or Wormwood. I'm just gonna give it to Wilson, because Wilson's been a cool man. Wilson's been the most righteous of dudes. Killed by freezing. I'm sorry, I know that wasn't the most polite thing to do on a public server. I know I probably should have saved them because it is the middle of winter, but also I'm like... Oh, I can't be bothered. Okay. Uh, thanks for the bird, I guess? Wilson? I uh, wasn't expecting you to give me a bird. But you know, I guess if that's what you want to do, my man, that's what you want to do. That is an appropriate reaction to cave. <laughs> me big strong man, me speak cave. When me say cave, you cave. Understand? <laughs> Sorry, I'm being stupid now. Did I make meatballs and then forget to eat them? I sure think I did. Which totally sounds like a me thing to do, so. Let's actually try and eat these meatballs this time. got that song stuck in my head. Oh boy. Just one more day basically and then we've got deer clops. Then this can all be over. Doesn't help either that no one's here to talk to, really. I try talking to Wilson and Wormwood, but you know, that's it's not the same. Okay. So um, let's go ahead then and not get destroyed by a tentacle, please. 
Fester, I, I, I do actually still need you alive, believe it or not, so please move. What? What? <laughs> Alright, I'm getting nice and searing hot. Okay, so we need to collect three more, or four more reeds if I want to make another map thingy for Wormwood. So where is this other reed? Here it is. Look, man, navigating in the dark is not easy. And it's especially dangerous in the swamp, right? So... Alright, let's head back to base. But hey, that uh, that moon ball thing that showed where base was actually did come in handy because a new person joined and tried to make it to our base. Unfortunately, they died along the way. But, you know what? At least they didn't have to ask the question, so where's base? <laughs> You know? And maybe we won't get to go on that boating adventure like I was uh, promising originally, but... Now, where is our wood? I would like wood. There's no wood. Okay, whatever. Hey, go to Warmwood, pal. I got something for you. How close is our tree? Ah, it's only two decorations away. Oh my goodness, the Wormwood even made a tent. How advanced. How advanced, indeed. How's life treating everyone? Huh? Hey Chester, you mind to open it up real quick? I need a good old repair on that beef flow hat. Thank you. Jerky is done. I see. Oops, didn't even harvest it. My bad. <laughs> All right, tonight's the big night. We're going to kill deer clops. Maybe I should inform the crew. Yeah, I think spring's day 36. go down into the cave, but isn't it, like, super cold down there during the winter? Like, sheesh, I don't wish for suicide, I just want to explore and have fun. 
We don't have any festive cheer still, which is sad. Uber sad. Man, he has nothing in this backpack. Weirdo. Hmm. Uh, boy, what do I want to do now? I feel like there's something I should be doing, but I don't know what. Killer bees still come out during winter? Ah, yes, of course. You know what? I know exactly what I can be doing right now. I could be making emergencies pierogi. Okay, so what do we need to make some emergency pierogi? Simple, really. We just need eggs. These can be turned into eggs. And... Two, no, one of these can be turned into eggs. And the rest of this can stay as is. In its cooked form. Three. Boom. Boom. So now we put one of these, one of these. One of these, one of these. One of these, one of these. Okay, so now we just need a vegetable for each. Uh, Wilson, you doing alright there, buddy? Oh. Come in. Sorry, I couldn't help out a little sooner there, Wilson. I didn't really want to use one of our big boy meats, but I might if I have to. Here comes the big boy. He is coming. Alright, time to fight for everything we stand for or something, I don't know. And here he is. Bernie! I forgot about Bernie! I knew I was forgetting something.
Oh no, he destroyed one of our bushes. And that was the uh, that was the stream. Hope everyone uh, enjoyed, and hope they enjoyed it more than I did. I'll work on fixing the previous stream because everyone knows I bonked that one up by leaving it on. Um, other than that, though, uh, yeah. Th thanks for people who hung out when they did. Bye. <laughs>